What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Comments here for you, Madden 18. Want to talk about reach tackling here inside run game. Really broken because of these interactions. Obviously, you have Darren Sproles trucking a defensive tackle. Should tell you just about everything that you need to know. But, you know, Madden has made some strides. Reach tackles really didn't used to be in Madden, but even implementing them in, they haven't fixed the game. Take a look at this reach right here from number 92 out into the lane to slow the running back. It looks good, but it's still not executed properly. What I'm going to do, back this up and run this play slowed down for you. I want you to watch the line as a whole. As soon as 92 reaches out, 64 actually releases. So now you've got a free release of the defensive tackle. And aside from that, the other two linemen are released as well. You take a look at the lineman there to the left. Take a look at number 90 in the back run doing a complete spin. And then also pay attention, number 32, bottom right-hand corner. He's going to run up and check himself almost. But at this point, only one lineman, number 74, is still holding his block. And that doesn't make sense when we're roughly three yards past the line of scrimmage and we're in an animation where I'm just running through a defensive tackle to begin with. And, you know, these are the things that need to be addressed for simulation football to be respected. And quite frankly, we just don't see enough of what the inside run game has to offer when you have linemen releasing like that. Love to know your thoughts on this, though. Appreciate you checking it out. You know that I'll be back in the week with more commentary.